friends, today we're going to read a very special book that I absolutely adore. It is called The Very Hungry Caterpillar, and it was written and illustrated by Eric Carroll. He's the one that drew the pictures and wrote the words. Let's get started. The Very Hungry Caterpillar. In the light of the moon, a little egg lay on a leaf. Here's the leaf. Here's the egg. Here's the moon. One Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and pop! Out of the egg came a tiny and very hungry caterpillar. He started to look for some food. On Monday, he ate through one apple, but he was still hungry. On Tuesday, he ate through two pears, but he was still hungry. On Wednesday, he ate through three plums, but he was still hungry. On Thursday, he ate through four strawberries but he was still hungry. On Friday, he ate through five oranges, but he was still hungry. On Saturday, he ate through one piece of chocolate, cake, one ice cream cone, one pickle, one slice of Swiss cheese, one slice of salami, one lollipop, one piece of cherry pie, one sausage, one cupcake, and one watermelon. That's a lot of food. The next day was Sunday again. The caterpillar ate through one nice green leaf and after that he felt much better here he goes now he wasn't hungry anymore and he wasn't a little caterpillar anymore he was a great big fat caterpillar he built a small house called a cocoon around himself. He stayed inside for more than two weeks. Then he nibbled a hole in the cocoon, pushed his way out, and he was a butter. A butterfly. The end. All right, my friends, in this story, we learned all about a caterpillar and how it becomes a butterfly. First, it was an egg. Then it was a very hungry caterpillar. Then it made its home out of a cocoon. And then it pushed its way out and it became a butterfly. I hope you like this story. I enjoyed it so much. See you next time.